Hola, soy Cristian Solís Calero y hoy voy a presentar un trabajo titulado A Molecular Dynamic Study of Interaction Between Baspin and Calicrein 7 and 14. This work was developed in the Department of Structural and Functional Biology in Universidad Estadual de Campiñas, in the laboratory of Dr. Hernández Carvalho. Voy a comenzar eh, hablando algo sobre Vaspina y Caligreinas Sechi y 14. Vaspina es una serie proteasa de la familia de serpings que se encuentra en several partes del cuerpo y es relacionada con several fisiológicas y patológicas procesos, como like obesidad, inflamación. Diabetes, through insulin resistance and other associated diseases. Baspin, as a uh, protease inhibitor, joined to proteases like calicrein 7 and 14, forming a Michaelis complex. But in the process of uh, binding, is generated at the final a uh, deformed pro uh, protease, and in this way is inhibited the activity of this enzyme. When these uh, proteases develop uh, their activity, for example, calicrein 7, they could, uh, for example, degrade other components uh, like insulin, having uh, consequences which are favorable for the developing of diseases like diabetes. When Baspin joins these proteases, no? uh, this process of degrading insulin is blocked. And in consequence, uh, the sick signaling uh, through insulin is increased. Baspin also uh, is related to other processes. For example, it blooms cytokine induced MKB signaling decreasing inflammatory gene expression. And a study um, in Germany uh, point out that uh, Baspin also could inhibit other, other calicreins. In this case, calicrein 14, mm -hmm. generating the possibility for this uh, serine protease inhibitor to regulate other processes. Then our purpose is analyzing the possible complementarity and specific interactions between Baspin and Caligrain 7 and Caligrain 14, which explain Baspin specificity against these proteases. Then we will perform a molecular dynamics simulation and study the interactions between Baspin and these proteases. Our methodology. In the case of calicrein 7, uh, there is a structure, protein structure in the database, in protein data bank. And in the case of calicrein 14, not, uh, it's not, there is not an experimental structure obtained. For this reason, for calicrein 14, through a modeling modeling was generated a, a structure, having a certain play, calicrein 7. Having the, the structures of both proteases, they, they were uh, joined, it was generated a, mo a, a, co a model of the complex between these proteases and BASPIN through a structural alignment opti and optimization, uh, taking as template the complex between serpin and trypsin. With the initial models of both complexes, both uh, were uh, the, the, the structure was uh, optimized using amber force field, and it was followed by a molecular dynamic simulation no? with a production of 100 nanoseconds. After that, that the obtained trajectories were analyzed through RMSD analysis, also interaction analysis, 
and calculated the binding free energy. Our results. According to our results, uh, through the, for example, in this case, we are showing the two dimensional RMSD analysis, the flexibility of conformational flexibility, variability of bus speed in both simulations. In this case, is showing the Calicrain 7 bus speed complex molecular dynamic simulation, and also in the case of Calicrain bus speed complex molecular dynamic simulation. The flexibility of bus spin is very similar, but, but when we are comparing, for example, the flexibility of Calicrain 7 and Calicrain 14, our results show that Calicrain 14 has a lower conformational variability. The decomposition analysis of the binding free energy on a per residue basis through MLGBS calculations has identified bus spin key residues for protein protein interaction between bus spin and calicrain 7, as we show in this slide. If we compare both uh, simulations, in this case calicrain 7 and in the next slide calicrain 14, we could see that the residues that are involved in the interactions are very similar. In the case of Baspin calicrain 14 complex, arginine 302 residue has not a favorable contribution to free energy binding along the simulation. This result is supported by kinetical experimental results which reveal a small increase in calicrain 14 inhibition by Baspin after arginine 302 to alanine mutation. The residue interaction network shows that the arginine 302 residue interacts with glutamic acid residue 379 in the case of calicrine 7 baspin complex, and this interaction is not appearing in the case of the calicrine 14 baspin complex. According to our results, the contributions to the free energy of binding of BASPIN residues, which interact directly with calicrain 7 and calicrain 14, are quite similar. However, the differences were found in interactions outside the active sites, such as arginine 302 interactions. Based on the obtained results, leucine 376, proline 377, Methionine 378 and, and glutamic acid 379 residues can be postulated as Baspin potential hot spots for its binding to calicrain 7 and calicrain 14, and by extension to other possible Baspin targets. We could give our acknowledgments to the institutions that gave us support for the developing of these works. Obrigado pela sua atenção.